Well, the man who first reported Lockie Hunter was not going to be picked tomorrow night was Tom Morris, who joins me now. Tom, what's changed in the past 24 hours? Yeah, evening to you, Kath. This is quite an incredible situation. So let me just lay out the facts for you as they are right here, right now. So Lockie, Lockie Hunter knew he was out this time last night. Not only did he know he was out, teammates knew he was out, other club staff knew he was out. Everyone at the Western Bulldogs uh, knew that Lockie Hunter was out of the 22 for tomorrow night's game against the Melbourne Football Club. I've since had it confirmed this morning that uh, from other people that Lockie Hunter was out as well. So for whatever reason, and I must stress, this is absolutely up to Luke Beveridge. It's his prerogative to change his mind uh, and name whatever team he sees fit. Lockie Hunter has come back into that squad for tomorrow night's game against the Demons. So clearly the circumstances have changed in the last 24 hours. It is a backflip, but I also wonder whether it's a tactic from Luke Beveridge. This was suggested to me by someone at the Western Bulldogs in the last few hours, whether it's a tactic from Luke Beveridge to actually give Lockie Hunter the kick up the backside that he apparently needs. I mean, Luke Beveridge is very clear... Um, that he wants all his players at their best at all times. He's got lots of midfielders. Um, he's got Jackson McRae and Marcus Bontempelli and Bailey Smith and Josh Dunkley and Tom Liberatore all over the ground. How's he going to fit them all into the one team? And I wonder whether this is the kick in the backside that he feels that Lockie Hunter needs. I'm also intrigued to see where Lockie Hunter starts tomorrow night. Yes, he's been selected on the wing. Will he start on the wing, as named? Or will he start on the bench? Will he be the medical sub? Or will he be a late withdrawal? I don't know. But what I do know is that this time yesterday, Lockie Hunter knew that he was out of the team to play on Wednesday night, and so did many of his teammates and other people at the club, which is intriguing in itself. What I do know as well, Kath, is that Luke Beveridge is full of surprises, and this was certainly one of them a few minutes ago when they named their squad for tomorrow.